So in this video we will demonstrate how to record, how to save the recording, how to come back to the recording at a later day, and how to continue with the process right up until the, the end when you're going to export the entire recording as an mp3 file. So we're going to start off with the recording of a chapter in the synthesis of yoga. And we will indicate that right at the beginning of the recording. So I start by pressing the record button. The synthesis of yoga, chapter 19, the planes of our existence. And now you would read, begin reading from the chapter 19 in a slow and steady voice. Now let's say you have read for quite a while and you need to stop. So you can stop the recording. Now everything you've recorded thus far you want to save. And so you go to the file menu and you go to save project as because you've not given it a name yet. And so we're going to call this chapter 19 synthesis of you. You can be as detailed as you want here, but notice this is going to get saved as an Audacity project file. And it's going to be put into a Audacity test files folder, which I previously created. And if I had not created, you could navigate your way to one there. And we're going to save. Now the project is saved in an Audacity project format. And I am going to quit Audacity because I'm going to go and have dinner or something. I'm coming back at a, another day or later that evening. And I'm going to continue. Audacity opens up with nothing in it. And you go to File. And it gives you recent files. And Notice Synthesis is right there. And I'm going to press that. Now. If I press the record button again, another track is created down here. And I don't want that. I want to continue at the end of the last track. So I'm going to delete that. And we're going to use a, um, I'm, I'm using the, the magnifying glass here to make this smaller so you can see the end of the track. And I'm going to use a keyboard shortcut, which is press the Shift key, keep it down, and then press the R key. And now notice that Audacity begins recording at the end of the previous track, rather than creating a new track. And this is called appending the recording. And you can do that also in the menus up here, where it shows append recording. Since I'm already doing it, it's grayed out. So it'll continue recording that way. So now you, you've finished again for the day or the hour, and you stop, and you need to save. This time, since you've already given it a name, you just, called it, you just go to Save Project. You close Audacity, and you go and do something else. You come back to record a third time because you haven't finished chapter 19. Open Audacity, go into File, Recent Files, and there's the synthesis. And now it's much longer because it has appended what I did in the second time. I again press the negative sign of the magnifying glass to zoom out so that I can see the end of the track. And notice the time is up here. A lot of things that we're not going to go over because it would involve quite a long video. So now I'm going to do again Shift R. And again, it begins recording at the end of the last track. And now I'm going to say I'm finished with the recording completely. And I end the recording by saying End of Chapter 19, The Planes of Our Existence, The Synthesis of Yoga. 
and I'm going to leave about 10 seconds at the end of the track of silence. And then I stop the recording. Now the recording is completely finished and I don't want to export yet because what I want to do is save the entire project as an Audacity project. Now the complete chapter is there from beginning to end along with the 10 seconds of silence at the end. Now I go to file and I go to export. And again, the title is there. The desktop where those other files were located, Audacity test files, are here. This is the project file in Audacity project file format, whereas this one is going to get stored as an MP3 file. And I say save. Again, we do not need to fill out any of the tags, and we say OK. That is the complete process from beginning to end of recording a chapter or a complete book as one long track. Hope that helps.